All right, Zakarado, you can go fuck yourself. God damn it. It's all his fault. It's all his fault. I was actually expecting there to be some kind of like loading shit, like, you know, loading title data. Installing the game, you know, whatever, for some reason that every PS3 game has now that tastes like, oh, hey, I just got this game and I'm totally hyped to play it. Let me give you, let me let me make you wait 10 to 15 minutes while we install this data, asshole. You don't get to be excited. Calm the fuck down. So that's what I was expecting and then it didn't happen. So we're off on a good start. Sonic the Hedgehog, nickname Sonic 06. Hey. Did not give you permission to do this. We're not ready to look at a trailer. So before I get this, I mean obviously this this is like the first true When will he quit? Oh here we go. Is this gonna take like no this shouldn't take that long. Yeah. This is the first true when will he quit kind of thing. It's like Magus didn't really count, because Magus wasn't really a game that would make me rage. It was just like it was just super simple and super dull, basically. Like, that was Magus. Whereas this game is actually legitimately awful. Everybody, let me actually check. I'm very curious. I just want to see. I want to see what this game's Metacritic score is real quick. So let's just search this shit. Guardians of the Galaxy has a 76 Metacritic rating? Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, it's got a 46 on the Xbox 360 and a 43 on the PS3. So let me just see, because I believe that's the review data. Oh my god, the user score is even lower. The user score is 3.9. Good god. Alright, let's see what it is on Xbox. Because I feel like Xbox people would be meaner. Oh no, it's higher actually. It's a 4.4 user score on Xbox. So anyway, this game is legendarily terrible. Just bad. Everything about it is bad. And here's the here's what's the, going to be even worse for me. Um, actually, I can use this as a moment to talk about my background with the Sonic the Hedgehog games. So, Sonic the Hedgehog was one of the very first video games I ever played. Um, the Sega Genesis was the very first game anything I ever had. And my parents bought me the Sega Genesis for Christmas and it came with this double pack game uh, not double pack game but it came with a with two games Lion King which was fucking awesome I loved that game I played the shit out of that game as a kid and Sonic the Hedgehog 2 played the shit out of that game as a kid loved it absolutely adored it uh, I owned Sonic the Hedgehog the original one and I ended up buying that later down the road uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 1, 2, and 3, and then I played the shit out of Sonic and Knuckles, but I never owned it. Never owned it. That was the first time I ever tasted betrayal. I'm just gonna tell you the story right here. Uh, when I was a kid, my friend, a good friend of mine, was se look looking to sell a bunch of his games. He wasn't interested in the games anymore so before GameStop was a thing, and so, you know, there wasn't the buy and tr trade and get money for your shit and whatnot, so I offered to buy Sonic and Knuckles because before then the only time I ever played it was renting it like I would always rent it I probably rented Sonic and Knuckles at least like 20 times from game stores uh, from game rental places whatever and so he had Sonic and Knuckles and he was looking to sell it and so I was like oh hell yes me mine dibs gimme gimme so we made an agreement and so his mother called and was like okay you know he's telling me that you want to buy this game I just wanted to make sure that this was true. I said, hell yeah, I want that game. Give it to me, bitch. And so she's like, okay, cool. We'll get back to you. Fast forward a day. Calls me back. Hey, so about that game you really wanted? His sister decided that she wants to keep it. So... I will never forgive that bitch. I'll never forgive that bitch. Never. I don't even care if she's a supermodel now and she wants to bang me. I'll be like, no! You screwed me out of Sonic and Knuckles. I will never let you screw me again. Never again. You made me bitter in life from that moment onward. Your fault. So that was my that that, that was uh, my experience with Sonic. And then obviously Sonic continued on past the Genesis, but I never went along with it because I never had this uh, Sega CD. I don't know how well received those versions of the, like the Sega CD games were 
And then obviously on Dreamcast, you had the Sonic Adventure games. Um, and I actually, I played the Sonic Adventure game, and I'll get into that in a second, but I didn't play it on Dreamcast. I didn't get to play it until it came out as a downloadable on the 360. I don't know if it's available on PSN 2, but I got it from Xbox Live Arcade. And so then you fast forward again, continue on, I basically skipped all the consoles. I was basically a portable dude, I only had the Game Boy. Um, until I won it, I ended up winning an Xbox. And so then, you know, continue fast forwarding, there wasn't any uh, Sonic games on the Xbox. But then the Xbox 360 came out, I played Sonic Heroes, which I actually enjoyed. Uh, there were certain, because obviously you had different teams. I enjoyed the Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles levels, but then the other levels could just, like, let's not talk about those. But I did actually enjoy that game when I was playing as Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. I thought that was a decent game. And then I haven't played a Sonic game since. I haven't played any of the, like, I've heard good things about Sonic Colors and Sonic Generations, but I've not played either one of them. Obviously, they had, you know, this game, then you had, like, Sonic Unleashed. Which were just awful games. Let me check the Metacritic score on that while I continue talking. So Sonic Adventure, and here's why this is going to probably be even worse for me than it usually would be. Sonic Adventure is a game that is generally well received. Uh, it's not... People thought that was a good game. I mean, obviously there... It's... You know, there's differences of opinion everywhere. Oh, Sonic Unleashed is actually a 60. So even Sonic Unleashed, that terrible shit, has a user score of 7.5. Huh. No shit. Um, but anyway, I didn't like Sonic Adventure. The style of the game, I just didn't particularly enjoy it. And this is similar to Sonic Adventure, just made even worse. Wow. Why are there like, why is there a Final Fantasy cutscene in my Sonic the Hedgehog game? Like this is literally, this is, I could see this cutscene being in Final Fantasy 13. like one of those moments there was actually this uh, I can't remember what movie it was for this was ages ago but there was this preview for this uh, upcoming animated dinosaur movie I think it was actually called just like dinosaurs or something. Oh, okay everything's burning yep this is your regular light-hearted Sonic the Hedgehog moment good demon that belongs in Devil May Cry no Final Fantasy not Devil May Cry Final Fantasy this is all Lighthearted children's stuff right here. But yeah, there was this preview for... I, I don't know if that was actually what it was called, if it was called Dinosaurs. But it was so... It looked like... It literally looked like it was the beginning of a movie. And so we were all sitting there like... Did we go into the wrong theater? Like, am I am I in the right movie? Like, wait a minute. This doesn't seem... Like, this is not the movie I signed up for. And that's kind of how I'm feeling right, right now. Like, this is not the video game I signed up for. Like, where am I? See, what is this? Like, all of a sudden, this is Final Fantasy. This is Final Fantasy. This is not Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention, uh, for this video, this video I'll make a little bit longer due to the fact, oh, now it's Sonic the Hedgehog because it's Dr. Robotnik. Oh, no, it's not even Dr. Robotnik anymore. It's Dr. Eggman. What the fuck? He looks wrong. I've come here to obtain the secret of the flames of disaster from you, and to take the miracle gems that are the key to its secret, the Chaos Emerald. She looks now, like princess, an eight-year-old boy. This way, please. She really does. She looks like an eight-year-old boy. Please tell me that's not Sonic. That's, a pretty that's really Sonic. There. <sighs> Drugs are really effective. Amidst my Final Fantasy game, I'm seeing a blue walking, talking hedgehog that can move at the speed of like light. There's our lighthearted children's moment amidst all this death and destruction. Oh, good, and now he's carrying off the princess.
So I guess shockwaves aren't a thing in this, in this, uh, it was triggered, yeah, whatever the fuck that is. In this world, shockwaves, concussive force, not a thing, because those missiles were literally exploding right next to him, and he just kept right on going. No problem. <laughs> Physics. Not a real thing. Fake. It's all a construct of the man to hold us down. No special reason. Wait, hold up. I'm gonna need to see her legs again. Why did she sudden? Why did she go from being like the palest, vampiric-looking person I've ever seen to having spray tan legs? I'm afraid our little game. But her upper body is still the same color. Sonic, take this. What's going? I'm, Nate's confused. I've got it. And don't worry, <laughs> I'll rescue you. Thanks, Sonic. I know. I've got it. How about you do something now while they're just fucking hovering there doing it's nothing? Of time before it's mine. Until then, you can hold on to it for me. The fuck kind of villain is that? You got your massive ass spaceship, tons of mechs at your disposal against one tiny little blue hedgehog. Go get the gym now! No wonder he always gets his ass kicked. Like, this dude is terrible. And he just stands there and watches them. Like, this dude could have run straight up them, up a building, leapt at him, jumped on that shit. No problem. All very well within the realms of Sonic the Hedgehog's capabilities. But nah. <laughs> We're just gonna stand there. What's Eggman up to? I, need to get I don't from know! Uh. Whoa, wait, what? Hold. He starts hella slow. Like, it takes him ages to get up to speed. Look at that. Alright. Okay. Whatever. If you see a mark above the head of someone in town, try talking to them. Okay, how do I talk you to them? may that? learn something important. Not with that button. How do I talk? Oh, there we go. The square button. Why does the hint dude have... Well, that... You did fucking nothing for me. How do I... Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, puppy. You here to see how terrible this game is? You're here to say that you are far more worthy of my attention than this Sonic the Hedgehog game? I don't disagree. I do not dis. Yo, what is going on with this? Ki oh. Oh. Uh, it's. Oh. Uh, that looks. Okay. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Oh, yes, I'm sure. Why does it automatically go to like. Bruh? way over here like hey you don't want to see your surroundings right of course not oh god shout out to just face it we just booted that into the ocean littering dog um okay so i think i have decided the people with yellow marks above their head are fucking huh? useless tails where's tails at i want tails tails is my boy there we go. See, there's some useful information. Ta oh, there he is. There, I see you. Popping in over there in the... F further away. Sonic! Tails! Long time no see. I'm glad you're here. I heard that you tried to save their princess from Dr. Eggman. No way! Let me pause between every word I say! I may not know what Eggman's up to, but it can't be a good thing. Okay. With your help, this should be a piece of cake. <laughs> I'll do my best.
Um. So I guess I just Maybe. talk to people. Huh? Why is mirror in quotations? Sonic, there's a nice store in this town. It might help you find a way to cross the sea. Okay, Sonic, where the fuck is it? There's a nice store in this town. I heard you the first time. Where the fuck it? Yo, did the frame like the frame rate just dead? Frame rate is just it just it it it, it dead. <laughs> This is a silver medal. They are oh boy, collectibles. It may be hard to collect them. Uh, can we not? Can we? Can we? That's um. Okay, there's a barrier there. Cool. So I guess I've got to find this shop they are so very subtly hinting at. If I could fucking control the camera. <laughs> ah, is that it? That must be it. With the money, you can shop in town. With Look the money? Often to check out the new <laughs> if you collect some monies, you could become riches. Hey. And we got a job talking black man. I don't have monies. Yes, but... Okay, so what do I do? Then how do I get... How do I get the monies? Hey. Const what construction? What fucking construction? This dude is hiding something. The government is hiding something. There is a conspiracy going down. Because there is no... Yo, um... So, so I need... What the fuck? What the... What the... What the... Slow down! Like... Nothing's even happening. We're literally in a level where... No, it's slowing down again. We're literally in a level where nothing fucking happens. How okay, I get I understand that I need to talk to people. That I need to oh is this dude different no that dude's still orange. Okay, I can't get over to the beach yet. I'm like I understand that I'm supposed to go to the shop and and get oh god. And get that thing that will allow me to I want to talk to him! And Tails just killed himself. I guess I can see the medal. They are scattered. Seriously, I don't want to. I really. It may be hard to collect them all. Is there, like, is there some kind of. Oh, Jesus, what did I do? What did I do? How did I do. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, how did I, how did I do that? I want to. How did I do that? Yo, for real, I have no idea how I did that. That's not it. Anyway, it's irrelevant. Dude, this slowdown is uh, literally absurd. There's nothing happening in this level. I can't even find what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing here. If you see a mark above the head of someone in town, try talking to them. Like, I need rings. So that I can buy that shit from this dude. But there are no rings. And there I can't go anywhere else. Every everywhere is blocked off by these guards. Oh, it's dude oh here we go. My bad. That was actually my that's entirely my fault. I've been um I'm assuming this blue shit. Yeah. Okay, so this is how I do it. My bad. That entire time I was assuming the uh the blue marker was for the merchant shop, not for that. That's my bad. <laughs> I'm sorry? The fuck was the... You gave me like a 30 second loading screen in order to give me one line of unspoken dialogue. Oh shit. Ah. Oh, okay, well the camera just went nuts. I'm no. Oh, there we go. Oh, 
Okay, I was gonna say, how the fuck do I get up there? But there's a bumper there. Whoa, whoa. He just said, I think I missed one of those. But it's like, you can't move at all, and then all of a sudden, look at that. You can barely move, and all of a sudden, hey, I'm gonna go fucking nuts! But seriously, did it really give, it gave me a 30 second cutscene, or a 30 second loading screen, for one line of unvoiced dialogue, and then continued on to another, <laughs> what was it loading? Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, motherfucker, I didn't get any rings for that, but what do I do? But, no, there it is. You'll get your moment, puppy. Don't you be whining at me. We got five out. This is. We got plenty of loading screens waiting hey. for us. Yes, I'm leaving already. You don't have any. Okay, so how do I? With the money, you can shop in town. Yeah, I hear Go that. But how do I? To check out the new items. Oh wait, wait, hold, hold on, hang on. No, no, no. Um. Um. Okay, good, good programming right there. But no, seriously, how do I? Oh, does this recenter automatically? Oh, that is gonna be a godsend. Okay, I'm gonna use the shit out of that. That's probably gonna piss people off that are watching though, because that's gotta be jarring if you're not expecting it. When you get close to the pile of rings, press the square button to do a light dash. Oh my god, I almost died. I pressed it three times, and if I oh Jesus! This is the mirror of Soliana. It will take you right to your destination. <laughs> oh, that would have been sad to die on the very first video. Actually, you know what? This is good. I'm going to continue onwards. Next video.